Here we are in Vincenzo's kitchen, and we've got a true delight for you today. This is a very diabetic-friendly, gluten-free pasta dish, and it is low-calorie, it is gluten-free, and it is diabetic-friendly, low-carbs. And so what I've done here is I've put my pan on medium heat, and I'm going to add a little bit of uh, a little bit of uh, extra virgin olive oil here, and we're just going to begin. So here we go. Got some nice virgin olive oil here. Going to throw a little bit in our pan. To that. We're going to add about a half a cup of mushrooms, get some sizzle going. And we're going to add some pepper stir fry to that. It's already been nuked in the microwave. Five minutes on one side, poke a hole in the bag, five minutes on the other side. So it's basically completely cooked. Nice and colorful, flavorful, very economic. Nice colors in the pan. You got red and yellow and some nice onion. And to that, we're going to add, and I'm going to bring this up close so you can see for yourself. This is what we're going to use for our pasta, our angel here. And there's various ways to cook this, but I'm going to cut this right out of the bag. The total on this is 10 calories, 4 carbs. And this is shirataki angel here style pasta shirataki there we go angel style pasta so you got some sizzle going there normally you'd cook that pasta for one minute pat it dry and serve it I'm going to turn my fire up here a little bit and I'm going to open him up and put him right in there after I drain off a little bit of the water. Just a little. Give it a squeeze on the corner. Expel the water out. I like that nice sizzling sound. We're going to open this guy up. The product of Japan. We've got some nice angel here pasta. You can see how nice it is. We're going to pop them right in there. Right into the pan. We're going to add him to that. Again, we've got our fire on high here, so we're going to watch this. We're going to mix this right into the pan on the stove top. I just think it's so fine for the 40 million diabetics out there and those that happen to have celiac, both of which I have. This is a great dish. Looks great on presentation. It's colorful, it's healthy, it's low-cal, carb-friendly. So we're just continuing to mix them in the pan. Got a lot of goodness in there. And what we're going to do now is we're going to add some of our 
Parmesan and Romano cheese. We're layering the flavor in. Not a ton, but a little bit. We're going to take some fresh ground pepper. Throw him in there. Give him some seasoning. We've already made up our meatballs, so we're going to put them right there on the plate. I have my pan propped up so he cooks evenly. We're going to give this another stir for a nice mix. The onions are already cooked, the mushrooms have been already sauteed. Give them a moment there. We're going to take them off the heat. plate him up. Going right around the plate. Getting all that goodness in there. Should have cooked off all the water by now, which it has. Kind of arrange them a little bit. And there we go. Now at this point, you can have this just like this. It's already been Parmesan. It's already nice and flavorful. I'm going to add some Italian style seven blend cheese on top of it. While it's pretty smoking, it'll melt right in there. And I'm going to take some of my wonderful sauce and put them right on the top of those meatballs which are again flavorful and we're just going to move some of that sauce around so you can see the meatballs we've got our shiitake angel hair pasta in the midst of that meatballs we've got pepper onion now that's a full plate there to eat. That weighs pounds. That's a po several pounds. So there you have it. Low cost, low calorie, low carb, gluten free, very flavorful, and you're good to go. Also, if anybody hasn't been made aware of my picnic table farming book, it's available on Amazon, Kindle, and hard copy format. Just chock full of nutritional information, how I do it. This is great for the seasoned garden guru, for someone who's just beginning. Great way to offset seasonal food insecurity. Know where your food comes from. Know how it's what's involved with it, no chemicals, no pesticides, organically grown, very convenient, highly efficient as far as water, work, weeding, that type of thing. So here we go, you've seen it right here, Vincenzo's Kitchen, a nice diabetic friendly, gluten free, full meal, Add some garlic bread that adds some garlic toast with it. Eat it as it is. I think you'll enjoy it. Good seeing you out there. Thanks for spending some time. I appreciate it. 
Remember to be kind to one another out there. Help your neighbor if you can. Enjoy the holidays. Alrighty, we'll see you.